Hello. This week, we talk about motivation in motion. Stay tuned. You and I, we need to talk. That the animal, so if you've been following this channel, you know I have an NGO I'm working on and it's motivation in motion. Well, about a month ago, we had our launch and we had a very big event dubbed Bank Your Portrait to raise funds to support the NGO's activities. But backdrop of the whole thing is um, the NGO is entirely supported by Bank Multimedia, which is my company. And at this point, I just decided to seek help from everybody who is benevolent to support us and the outcome is is encouraging because at the launch of the event we had a lot of people coming to pledge and to uh, donate and to give us directions as to where and how to go about our activities so it was a quite successful event but the ngo has a cycle and we are almost at the last part of the cycle which is the kids we pick from these schools um, we want to give them some exposure we want to take them on exposure tours as we name it and basically what this tours are supposed to do is that we want to make these children meet their role models or to meet um, just general role models who could motivate the kids onto the right path so what we want to do now is our final stage that is in december we want to have a tour with a selected few of the kids and take them to nice places that they normally would not have gone to because these kids grow up in um less deprived areas okay and they don't get to go outside their neighborhoods so this december we want to give them that exposure for them to go outside their neighborhoods and to socialize a bit and also to meet um, role models in their working environment so that they can pick some tits and bits you know from those environments so basically this is what we want to do we we'll have a bus carry these kids take them round town show them some um, iconic places in Accra also take them to some few role models who would be available on the day and then we have them interact with the kids and bring them back have some small refreshments for the kids and send them back to school so basically that's the end of the cycle so why am i saying all this now up to this level we've tried to do everything on our own to sponsor everything on our own but at some point we want to seek for more help because it's becoming a bit more difficult as we grow so as an ngo we want to open up and invite people across borders all right if you think you could support these kids in any way basically the support we need mostly will be finance but if you have any help that you think would help school children school children normally the age brackets we are looking at is from upper primary which is we call it class four to jss or jhs three that age bracket is normally around let's say nine to twelve or thirteen that way so those are the age brackets we are looking at we have a lot of people um, trying to get in touch with us or getting in touch with us and supporting which we we appreciate a lot we have people even outside ghana trying to give us um, school items to support these kids with which we appreciate a lot so we want to open up and invite as much help as we can for this store we we want we are we are organizing buses we are organizing refreshments and basically those things are so important for us at this particular time this december time 
we want to take these kids around so if there's any support anybody could give us to support these kids we would be so happy and we would we would appreciate it so much so basically this episode i want to just send this message across that whoever is touched by what we are doing and would want to help we would put our contacts and details in the description below this video so that you could look and get to us and support us in your small way and one thing that we realize from our events is some people think that we have money that's why we are doing this thing somebody actually said this that you people you have money that's why you are doing this but you see it's it's very sad to hear such things because i don't have all it takes to to help these kids i don't have all it takes to do everything i want to do for these kids but the little that we can come up with that's what we try to do so that's why i'm coming out and opening up and saying that if you want to help come and help us and show your love sometimes it's just the time and the effort you can come and put into these things that we appreciate a lot because it's just a team of young people trying to help some children around and the numbers are sometimes overwhelming so please we don't have it all we don't we are not so comfortable that's why we are helping people we are helping people even in the times that we are also um, in need of help so let's all be generous let's all try and help and in any way that you can help please contact us and we would appreciate it so much so thank you for watching and yeah this is the end of this episode see you next week i hope you enjoyed Mwah.